Vaheguru Ji Ka Khalsa, Vaheguru Ji Ki Fateh. You're probably not going to like this video. I don't really want to film it, but it has to be said, it's the truth. Why and how Sikhs are killing Sikh here? You might think, Enu Ki Pata Goriye. Yeah, but I tell you. So I consider myself a Sikh, and therefore I feel that I can say these things. So um, if we look behind me, trees, yeah? So trees got a roots, trees got a trunk, trees got branches. And we say we live in multicultural society, everybody's equal. Okay, it's a big forest, yeah, big forest. There's loads of trees, all of them are high. So let's look at the Sikhi tree, the tree of Sikhi. The tree of Sikhi, if we live in multicultural society and everybody's equal, the Sikhi tree should be as tall as all the other trees. But what are we doing to it? Shall I tell you what we're doing to it? I'll tell you. There's Diwali coming up. Bandi Chor, for Sikhs is Bandi Chor. We say, no, 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 it's Diwali, let's celebrate Diwali. So we take one root, chop it off, yeah? Okay, tree still standing. Comes Hola Mahalla. What do we say? Holy, let's play colors. Yeah, it's a holy. Okay, fine. Cut another root off. Then December, Chote Saib Zade. And people say, no, 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 Chote Saib Zade. That's very tragic for our children. We shouldn't tell them this story. Let's celebrate Christmas. Let's give them presents. Forget the Chote Saib Zade. We'll mention it some other time. So this is a massive part of our history. It's such an inspirational story for children. What do we do? We don't even mention it to the children. That's another root gone. Okay. Then we send our children to school. My child's name is Gurpreet Singh. And then there's a Gora teacher and we say, oh no, Gurpreet is too hard for you to say. Say Gurpreet. Gurpreet. So Gurpreet. Love for the Guru. Where is this love gone? It's gone. It became Gurpreet. What does that mean? It means nothing. So if we're in the forest and we look at all the trees and we say we strive for equality, six preach equality. But how can you be equal if your tree, the tree of Sikhi, you don't let it grow. We chop off the roots, roots are the traditions. We don't have the Sikhi traditions, we replace them with other things. Then another good one. They tell you we live in multicultural society, so that's, let, let's all speak English. Why do we need to learn Punjabi? Why do we need to know Punjabi and to be able to teach it to our children? It's because of Gurbani. It's not because of the Punjabi culture and Pangara and whatnot. It's because of Gurbani. So when I can't tell my child who is seven or five now, I can tell them, bring them to Gurdwara. But then when they're 13, 14, they might say, mommy, I don't want to go. But then at that age, they should be able to understand Gurbani and they want to go themselves to connect with Guruji. We don't force them. At that time, they should be able to understand Gurbani because we taught them enough Punjabi to understand it. Other very important thing is the other tradi other parts, like other arts that included in Sikh culture. For example, Gurbani calligraphy. For example, Shastar Vidya, Gatka. For example, Rag, music. For ex we, we're in Singapore now, and we just walked past the Chinese prime, uh, nursery school. And they had all these things, Chinese calligraphy, some tea appreciation, Chinese language. And take any normal Punjabi school or Sikh school across the world, you won't find those things. They don't teach Sikhi arts, they don't, hardly anybody teaches Rag Vidya, hardly anybody teaches Gurbani calligraphy or uh, Shastar Vidya or anything like this. These things are thrown out and all you have to do is, okay, tick the box. Sunday I went to Gurdwara, I done Matha, I done, um, I had Prashad, I had Langar. That's what we do. We do tick box, tick box, tick box, but it doesn't, it doesn't work like this. We have to grow the tree, put the seeds in our children when they're young and let them grow and we have to nourish them. We need to give our children and ourselves strong roots so the tree trunks stand steady and strong and tall. And then we can grow big branches and the beautiful fruit will come out of it and give shade to everybody else and be equal with every other faith and society and culture in the world. Multiculturalism doesn't mean monoculturalism. It doesn't mean we all have to be the same. We don't have to be the same as Russians. We don't have to be the same as Chinese or Philippine or whatnot. We have to have pride in our Sikhi. We have to be strong in our Sikhi. We have to let it flourish, let it grow, and grow as tall, even if not taller than other trees in the forest. Wahiguruji ka khalsa, 
ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕੀ ਫਤਿਹ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ 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 ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ